Hey, it's Matt from Tradesman Digital Marketing. In today's video, I'm gonna walk you through manual CPC versus maximized clicks. I'm gonna go over what they are, what the differences are, and how to set them up in your account if you choose to use one of them. So to start off, what is manual CPC building? And most people are pretty familiar with manual CPC bidding. It allows you to adjust every single keyword, what you want to bid for every single keyword. Now, this may sound awesome, and it really was the predominant bidding strategy for a very long time until Google's AI got really good. What used to be really good about it was the only real factors inside Google Ads you control were the actual dollar value you're going to place for your keyword. Now, this would take a real long time, and that's why a lot of the agencies, they still use them just to show people that, hey, we are doing stuff. However, they tend to get worse results now because Google's AI has gotten so good at figuring out what keywords to actually bid on that actually increasing and decreasing the bids manually doesn't perform as well as most of the AI strategies. And that's why here at Tradesman Digital Marketing, we recommend most accounts use automated bidding strategies just because they perform so much better than manual CPC and they don't waste as much time having to go in and adjust every single keyword. Uh, it's just not fun to actually go in and adjust every single keyword. As fun as that sounds, it doesn't sound very fun. <laughs> but um, yeah, manual CPC really was the predominant bidding strategy, but it kind of went the way of the dinosaurs just because better things came along. Now you can still use manual CPC if you choose to do so. And I'm sure there are circumstances where manual CPC makes sense just for most service businesses. And what we see, they just don't really make sense for most of them. But if you're interested in manual CPC, I have a whole video on that. I'll link it up somewhere here below if you want to go more in depth into that. But now the actual difference between manual CPC and maximize clicks. And a lot of people get these two confused. And I think because they're kind of closely related, they think, well, manual CPC, they're going to be getting a lot of clicks and maximize clicks is you know getting clicks so what is the difference well manual cpc really doesn't have the flexibility maximize clicks does and google can really go after a whole bunch of different keywords with maximize clicks where with manual cpc it's kind of stuck and if you set a bid limit of let's say six dollars and you can get a click for six dollars and fifty cents you're not going to get that click however with maximize clicks google's going to see like hey this is the most amount of clicks we can get today uh, we do have to bid six dollars and fifty cents for it but that's what we're going to bid and maximize clicks really tries to bring in as much data as possible as quickly as possible where manual cpc there's no automated process behind this it is very machine like in the sense that it does not change at all if you set a bid limit it's not going to go over that unless you're using enhanced cpc however that again only has a certain amount of flexibility as well so maximize clicks really allows you to get the most amount of clicks out of your budget and allow you to bring in as much data into the account as possible now for most accounts we recommend an account actually start off and maximize clicks at least for service-based businesses and this allows google to bring in as much data as possible could you do it in manual cpc absolutely uh, but maximize clicks we find it's just easier and it produces better results by getting the most amount of clicks possible and what we really want to aim for in month one is to collect as much data as possible and then a month two and three transfer it over to an automating bidding strategy and the reason we do this is because in order for google AI to make a decision it needs data and if we don't have data it's going to make bad decisions or it's going to be very slow in the optimization process because it doesn't know what to do because it doesn't have the data with maximized clicks we bring in a whole bunch of clicks yes some will work yes some will won't work however once we have the data we can give it to google's ai and it can perform a whole lot better than if it didn't have this data so that's generally how we go about looking at these strategies now if we want to apply this to our actual campaign it's quite simple all we have to do is come over here to our google ads account come over here to settings and then we can click on a campaign here let's do the lead search campaign for whatever reason and then what we're going to do is come over here to bidding it's set to manual cpc already so i'll change it over to uh, maximize clicks here very simple to do what i always recommend doing is setting a maximum cost per click bin limit i generally recommend going through your keyword planner finding you know 75 percent of your highest bid of the actual keyword and then applying that to this so if say your highest range is you know 20 dollars, i would say take 15 dollars put it in there and see how it runs. This is just a nice fail safe. So for whatever reason, if Google goes, hey, there's only like one click today and it's worth $80, it won't spend that $80 and won't blow your entire budget, which is nice. So there's always a fail safe here. All we have to do from here after we set our maximum cost per click bid limit is hit save. And now we've set our account to maximize clicks. Now, if we wanna set it to manual CPC, all we have to do is come back in here, change bid strategy, scroll down here, hit select bid strategy directly, not recommended because Google doesn't want us to use a manual CPC bid strategy. We're just going to scroll down to the bottom here in manual CPC and we can turn enhanced CPC off if we want 
just standard manual CPC. If you want enhanced CPC for whatever reason, check it off. I generally find it does produce better results with enhanced CPC, but it's up to you. We'll just leave it in manual CPC for this one, and then we'll hit save. And now we successfully set our account to manual CPC. So that's the difference between maximize clicks and manual CPC. Now, a quick word from today's video sponsor. If you're looking to build out a Google Ads campaign, maybe you don't have all the resources, maybe you don't have an amazing website, conversion tracking, and you just don't have all the time in the world, check out our call only ads course. It's very simple, it walks you through how to bring in high quality, sustainable leads month after month. Very simple, walks you through how to set up the campaign, how to optimize it, what to look for, common problems associated with the account. It walks you through everything so you are, so you, so you can have a successful campaign inside Google Ads. Again, very simple, very easy to use. There's a whole bunch of stuff in here that walks you through how to keep your account running well and really how to stay ahead of your competition. So if you're interested in that, come check it out. It's in the link down below. It, it's in the link down below. Now that's it for now that's it for today's video. If you have any questions regarding manual CPC, maximize clicks, the differences, uh, leave a comment down below. I'd be happy to answer it. On that, you guys have a wonderful day and take care.